Hi, this is Paul from the Outdoor Adventure, and today uh, I'm up on a glacier, and I forgot to bring my sunglasses. And this is something, uh, obviously, uh, I should have thought about before. It was overcast, and uh, I figured that I'd be all right. Had my hat on, but it is incredibly bright. At the moment, it's overcast. It keeps coming cloudy and, and clear, but. Uh, I was already starting to feel the effects. You could see the, the, the bright stars dancing around. And um, so uh, I was looking, going to look through my bag. I was looking through it a bit earlier and I found some stuff to, uh, to potentially help me on my, uh, on my trip back. Because uh, if you're going to be out on a glacier all day in the sun, you do not want to get anything like snow blindness. And this is a trick probably many of you s have seen, but uh, it demonstrates that. Uh, it's important to be prepared for situations and at least have the materials with which you can uh, make something. So amongst all my uh, gear that I brought with me, most of it food and mountaineering gear, I have a section of paracord, not very long, but uh, it's one thing. I've also got this uh, plastic lunch bag. What else, dude? Okay, I did bring it. So I have here, right now here, my uh, knife. So I think we're going to be set. So now I'm going to set to work fashioning some snow goggles. Now the idea is to put small holes in them so that you can uh, see through, but it doesn't let a lot of light through. So this is uh, predating sunglasses. So let's just uh, find a place where we can set up and start putting that together. <coughs> now, I'm going to open this up. <coughs> now if you have a set of glasses, this can be easier because all you have to do is uh, tape that, cut it to the frame, and then tie it around the edges, and uh, and you're set. So I'm going to do that first with a set of glasses. I'm going to mark it. Now this is just light paper, so I'm going to use the back edge of the knife so I don't dull off my knife. and keep it safe. I'm just going to tear along that line I scored. Put that to the edge. Now, this is 550 pound breaking strength paracord and I don't need that. And I can make better use of it if I just take a section. I don't need a long section. Cut it off. Now use the frayed end to pull out this seven strands if it's the, the better quality stuff. You have seven strands now. A string which are still very strong in the, in, in the at the end of themselves. So I'm going to use that to help this go farther. Now, what the idea is going to be is to tie this around, but to leave as much of this on there as possible to give more protection for my eyes. To help me. Before I put this on my glasses, because of course you don't want to scratch your glasses if you have glasses, I'm going to uh, score those holes. Now any piece of rock will do in this. Just make yourself a couple small holes. I'm 
not too too much just enough to be able to see through and you'll be surprised when you put these holes right up to your eye how much you can see all right to give you an idea i'm gonna hold this up to the camera see how much you can see with these all right so i have these made they're centered on where i see i need them i'm going to wrap them around and i'm just going to tie that off Now if you're uh, looking to uh, do something a bit, uh, we're looking for have, to have something a bit longer lasting, you know, the traditional way was to use a bark to uh, do this, like a birch bark, because birch bark when you peel it off often has the holes from the little notches. Piece of cloth. That's all you have. All right, one side done. It's not pretty, but and it l looks like it's good timing because the sun is starting to come out strong again. The clouds have gone away. <laughs> Actually, came up here to do a video review. So uh, that's why I have a couple extra things along with me. But uh, I'm glad I did bring them cause, because I'm a fair distance up the glacier and it was really hurting my eyes. I'm not joking, I'm at, plus you think I'm at uh, around 18,000 feet right now, believe it or not. And uh, it really, uh, that sun really, really kills. All right, so you're not gonna win any awards for fashion, but it gives me enough uh, visibility so that I can navigate a glacier, navigate these rocks without difficulty. And uh, at the same time, it's protecting my eyes so that there's no long-term damage to my vision. Well, there you go. It's always good to have the tools and the uh, skills on hand so that when it comes to an emergency or a potential emergency, you're ready to uh, handle it. Thanks, this is Paul from The Outdoor Adventure. Try it out. If you've tried it or you want to try it, please post a video response. I'd love to see your comments, your experiences, or uh, how uh, you do a better job than I do.